Okay, it says here, Mr. Keller filled out a bracket for the NCAA National Tournament. Based on his knowledge of college basketball, he has a .49 probability of guessing any one game correctly. So we have P equals .49. Uh, it says, what is the probability that Mr. Keller will pick exactly 11 games correctly in his first round? So the trials... There are 32 rounds in the first, I'm sorry, 32 games in the first round. So there'll be 32 trials. We're looking for the probability of X being exactly 11. So we just go to distributions, binomial PDF, we're looking for an exact value. Trials is 32, success rate is 49%, looking for an X value of 11. So we get 0 0.036458 or 0 0.03646. Hey, yep. All right. What is the probability he'll pick exactly 25 games incorrectly? Well, if he gets 25 games wrong and there's 32 games, that's the same thing as saying he gets seven games correct. So it's just going to be the same thing, except now we're talking about 7 instead of 11. 0 0.001116. Okay. All right, it says US, Air USA has a policy of booking as many as 16 persons on an airplane that can seat only 14. So they overbooked by two people. Past studies have revealed that only 83% of the booked passengers actually arrive for the flight. Find the probability that if Air USA books 16 persons, not enough seats will be available. So we need to find the probability of 15 people showing up, that X equals 15, and the probability of having all 16 show up. If either one of these things happens, there's not enough seats. So we're gonna find this probability and add it to this probability. Okay. Otherwise, we don't have any issues. But this is a binomial as well. So we're looking at trials is uh, 16 people. Each one has a probability of 83%. We're looking for the chance that 15 people show up. So I'm just going to leave that the way it is. I'm going to do the same thing. Actually, I can just grab this one and change this to 16 people showing up. And then I can just take these two values and add them together. So the probability that you will have overbooked the plane will be 21.697% or 21.70%. It probably wants it as a decimal because it says probability, not percentage. So we'll just do 0.21697. And that's it.